Hello, everyone. Welcome back to Sing Academy 2025 Mexican Group Test Prep. Here's our today's question. You can pause the video, try to solve it by yourself first. Okay, time's up. Let's check this question together. On each side of six faces of a cube, there are different numbers of dots from one to six. In the picture, we can see the cube show in two different positions. Which number is on the opposite face of number four? First, let's see, we have a cube here. Do you know how many faces we have for one cube? We have six faces. And they are all different numbers from one to six. What does that mean? Can I see two ones in my cube? No. Can I say two twos? Definitely no. It means every number from one to six only appear once in this cube. And we already see the cube show in two different positions. So we call this A and we call this B. The question asking us, which number is on the opposite side of number four? Uh, let's see, I cannot find any number four here, either in A or B, right? Um, let's see, A and B. Do you find anything in common? Oh yes, we both have number one. So how about let's try to find what's the opposite side of number one first, okay? Uh, from position eight, number five is right next to number one. Can we say they're opposite? No. So we already know number one cannot be opposite uh, of number five. And we can see number six is also next to number one, right? So they cannot be opposite to each other. So also cannot be number six. Let's see position B. Uh, we can see from the picture, number one is next to number three, right? So they cannot be opposite side of each other, which means cannot be number three neither. Let's see, number one is next to our number two as well, which means number one cannot be the opposite face of number two. Um, since we already find number one cannot be on the opposite face of number five or number six or number three or number two, do you find anything interesting? Yes, we only have one number left. Which number? Number four, which means number one is the number on the opposite face of number four. So for this question, we should choose A. That's how we solve this kind of problem. First, we observe the picture. Try to find anything in common and use elimination method to find the final answer here. Did you also get the same answer as me? Good job! And that will be all for our 5 days question explanation. You just made it! Congratulations again!